Welcome to Fire Engineering Training Minutes. I'm Sean Gray. This is Captain Chad Christensen from Los Angeles County Fire Department. What we're going to show you today is exterior fire attack, i.e. transitional attack. The important thing about this technique is that it's a quick action of opportunity. Fire is blowing out of this second story window. He's going to quickly hit it and then move to the interior. There's no delay for exterior streams. All we're doing is we're knocking down the room that has flashed over above us and we're getting inside as quickly as possible. Take it over, Chad. So as a firefighter approaches that second floor window where he notices that fire is coming out of that second floor, he's going to want to apply water from that exterior position, hitting it hard from the yard, that transitional attack or exterior water application, however you want to refer to it as. He's going to take the nozzle into his hand and he's going to apply water at a steep angle to that front third of that window sill above the window. Go ahead. As he's as he's flowing that straight stream towards the ceiling in a continuous flow, the gases are cooling from the top down, contracting that thermal layer and cooling those gases in that room, resetting that fire. This tactic of opportunity, you continue to flow your water until you see those gases change. Once you see a positive effect take place in that room, you shut your line down and make your move towards the interior. As we talk about exterior water application or transitional attack, it's a tactic of opportunity, but it doesn't necessarily always need to be on the second floor. It could be a first floor window that's venting fire out, and as you go past it, you put your stream through the window. As you're gonna see with this firefighter as he takes his kneeling position towards the base of the windowsill, still looking to get that steep angle and getting towards the front third of that ceiling inside the window. He gives short bursts of water, banking it off the ceiling, taking tactical pauses to ensure that he's seeing conditions changing. One thing he's also doing is ensuring that that straight stream, as it's flowing in that window, is allowing those superheated gases as they're expanding from the steam conversion to contract and exhaust out that window around the stream. Once he sees a change of conditions, he shuts his line down, he looks in the window because he's on the first floor and cools any obvious objects that are on fire in that room and heads towards the interior to put the rest of the fire out. Today we've given you some options of how to apply water from an exterior position. Remember, it's a tactic of opportunity. If you got fire coming out of a window, you got a nozzle in your hand, flow some water, reset that fire, and make it safer for us and any potential victims on the interior. Thanks for watching Fire Engineering Training Minutes.